Hi church, it's great to be with you again as we continue our journey of knowing God. And today uh, we're going to look at Jehovah Shalom, the Lord is my peace. In Judges 6 verse 24, it says that Gideon built an altar there to the Lord and named it, the Lord is my peace. Gideon was a judge in the Old Testament and he knew a lot about needing to know God as his peace. He led a military campaign of campaign of 300 faith-filled Israelites against 135,000 Midianite soldiers who were experienced in military. His soldiers weren't. He faced a daunting task. Fear surrounded him, as well as maybe stress, anxiety, and confusion. But it wasn't in him. It might have been around him, but it wasn't in him. He had peace because he knew his God, and it led him to build an altar and call it the Lord is peace. The name Jehovah Shalom appears only once in the Bible in Judges 6 verse 24, and yet this characteristic of God is both powerful and essential in our daily lives. In a world that can seem so powerful, so full of drama, chaos and fear, where every channel, news outlet and social media post can draw you into stress and anxiety, where things can seem uncertain and confusion grows, it is important to know that God is not only peace, but that he has give, already given us this peace through Jesus Christ. Scripture tells us that Jesus is the Prince of Peace. And in John 14 verse 27, Jesus says, Peace I leave with you, my peace I give to you. I do not give it to you as the world gives. Do not let your hearts be troubled and do not let them be afraid. So whatever is going on around you or whatever you are going through, let's stop for a moment, press pause and speak. Jehovah Shalom, the Lord is my peace. Love you, church. See you tomorrow.